parang neneng bi ang kanyang katawan What is up YouTube? Alright, so I haven't gone to the gym in like three days. Why? Because I had I woke up one day and I had the stiffest neck guys. It was nuts. Felt like I needed to go to the hospital or something, but you know what? I'm a man so I sucked it up, but man, it was so bad that I couldn't even get up like like an inch of movement of my neck I mean right now it still hurts but not as bad as before but man that stiff neck was really bad I had a hard time like that one day or actually it, it took like three days well that one day guys it was so bad I couldn't even move my neck it, it felt like <laughs> it felt really bad so I told myself I uh, I didn't want to like um, apply pressure to it so I rested for like a good three days and not going to the gym for three days was really um, depressing I guess I, I felt in my day wasn't complete you know like it felt like I was missing something if I uh, if I didn't gym so yeah those two days I mean those three days I felt I felt my day was incomplete because I didn't go to the gym, but um, I told myself I was going to go to the gym today. Um, it's not as bad as before. Look, I could, I could move my head back and forth now. Before, I couldn't even do this. Like, I, it would hurt as soon as I got here, but now, look at that. I could actually move my neck now. And, uh, yeah, I drank. I put like a, a lot of Katinko for, for all you Filipinos out there. Katinko guys, it, that shit is the bomb. I use it for everything, going to sleep, um, muscle aches, massages, stuff like that. But uh, other than that guys, today's push day. I'm gonna do some chest, shoulder, tricep workout, and, uh, and get back to my routine definitely not as heavy because my neck is still hurting but I'm definitely gonna do some uh, I'm definitely gonna make it worth it today came early I'm gonna finish late so uh push workout here we go all right so my first machine is the decline bench press I did about three to four sets at six to seven rep range I did my reps really slow, find that more effective, you know, you get that mind-muscle connection going on, and uh, if you look at my arms, look how shaky it is, that's how much, that's how much work I'm putting in, look at that, look at that shake, boom, I love it, love it guys. Not as heavy sets because uh, I'm trying to keep it safe today. But when I'm at 100% recovered, I'm definitely gonna go even heavier. But for now, keeping it safe, guys. I'm not trying to ego lift and end up getting injured more. You know, I'm just, just trying to slowly get back into. Uh, my old routine. Next workout is the ladder arrays yeah. with my palms in just to target a different muscle group. I did three slow reps followed by five reps. I did that a few times until failure. One, two, three, three. Check out that face guys. You can't fake the hardship of that face.
three, one. One, two, three. Oh. Oh. Three. Oh. Two. Three. Four. Five. Oh. Next machine is the same workout, but this time with my palms down. The usual lateral raise, dumbbell lateral raise. I use 10 pounds, I believe. Yeah, 10 pounds. I did three slow reps, followed by five quick reps. I did it until failure. This right here, guys, is what you call killer burnout set. You grab some light weights. Right here, I'm working with eight pounds. I did five reps, both sides. Hold the other one, do five on the other side. Switch, do five on the other side. And then four, four on the one side, four on the other side. Three, two, one. And then, once you do all that, you do 10 full reps. This shit burns, guys. Look at that face. That's some real pain. P-A-I-N. Pain. Next is the flat bench press. I did 160 pounds, slow reps, and then three quick reps. I did four sets. Three. Three. I could have done more reps, but I'm not trying to kill myself, man. I'm still recovering, so I'm just uh, I'm just doing like enough to where I struggle with the last rep. That's about it. I usually push more, like add an additional one extra rep, but I'm not fully recovered, so I'm just gonna keep it safe. Next up is the front raise, but with my thumbs up, I did two sets. I did five quick reps, followed by three slow reps, and then five quick reps again. I tried doing uh, slow reps 
again, but man, shit's a killer. So I did two sets of those, and then on my next, and then another two sets, this time with the palms down. This right here is the palms down one guys. Same thing, five fast reps followed by three slow reps. Next are the cables. Did three slow reps, slow reps, followed by five quick reps. Just enough to where I hit failure. Next up is an ab workout. This right here is one of my favorite uh, leg raises. Really effective guys. You could probably do a good 10 reps and you'll start hurting. But the trick to this guys is if you, if you hold the bar with your palms in, not palms out, palms in. So you get that better um, support. This is a tri pull down. I did three slow reps followed by five quick reps. Definitely burn. I did three sets with these guys on both sides, on both arms. Ah! 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 
there you have it guys finished my push workout chest shoulder triceps and uh always got to do abs man so even if it's like a, a few sets but just gotta do abs that's it for my video guys hope you guys got some uh, golden nuggets out of this um please hit that like and subscribe button and uh i'll see you guys on my next video i'm rick sanchez i'm out peace